Hello everybody and welcome to Sophie Sweets Academy. My name is Sophie and today I will be showing you how to make these chocolate and caramel pretzel rods. I call these lit up pretzel rods. The spiral is actually all caramel so in each bite you will have chocolate and caramel in your taste buds. So if you'd like to learn how to make these then please keep watching. You will need pretzel rods mini M&M's, green candy melts, coconut oil, chewy caramels, just like this. And I forgot to include here, but you also need powdered sugar. For the packaging, I have this cute little tin box as well as some tissue paper. Start by melting your chocolate, since this will take the longest. I have a chocolate heater, but if you don't have one, pop your chocolate in the microwave and heat in 30 second intervals. To get it nice and runny, you'll need to add coconut oil. Next, pop your caramel in the microwave for 15 to 20 seconds. It should be easy to work with. Up next, get your powdered sugar and coat your hands as well as your surface. This will prevent the caramel from sticking to you. Make sure that the caramel is not too hot. Now roll the caramel depending on how thick you'd like it. You can't really go wrong with thick or thin here. Time to wrap it up. To seal, push and flatten the caramel onto the pretzel. Ta-da! Now add your melted chocolate into a cup. And we are ready to dip. Make sure that the chocolate goes all the way to the edge of the cup. If you want to coat the pretzels more, then get a longer cup to cover more area. My cup here wasn't long enough, but it's okay because the caramel is easy to cut. Now shake the excess chocolate off. Before it sets, add your M&M's. If the chocolate is too hot, then the M&M's will slide down. Oh no! Don't worry, we'll fix it later.
This is the part where we fix our mistakes. If you have excess chocolate that dried, don't worry about it. Just get a knife and shave it down. Remember, chocolate isn't the easiest to work with, so it won't always come out perfect, and that's okay. Time for the packaging. You can get really creative here. You can add shredded filler, multiple gift wrap colors, candy, literally anything to make this box more special. And we're all done. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed making these with me. Please share with your loved ones and stay tuned for my next video. Bye.